We're at war. No one wants to admit it, but humanity is under attack. While you've been sleeping, entire colonies have been disappearing. Human colonies. We believe it's someone working for the Reapers, just as Saren and the Geth ate its sovereign. You've seen it yourself. You bested all of them. That's just one reason we chose you. If you're after the Reapers, just point me in the right direction. Miranda was worried you'd be resistant. She's not usually wrong. I have a shuttle ready to take you to Freedom's Progress, the latest colony to be abducted. Miranda and Jacob will brief you. I'll get what you're looking for and be back before you know it. Good to hear it. Find any clues you can. Who's abducting the colonies? Do they have any connection to the Reapers? I brought you back. It's up to you to do the rest. Stop right there! Fraza, you said you'd let me handle this. Wait, Shepard? I'm not taking any chances with Cerberus operatives. Put those weapons down! Shepard, is that... you're alive? Cerberus rebuilt me, Tally. In return, they asked me to investigate these attacks on human colonies. You'll pardon us for not taking you at your word, Cerberus. We're well within our rights to investigate attacks on a human colony. I'd like to know what the Quarians are doing here. One of our people was here on pilgrimage. His name was Vitor. You should head back to your ship, Tally. We'll let you know when we find Vitor. Like hell. I'm not letting Cerberus take over. Neither am I, Praza. I don't want to fight you, Shepard. But I can't just let Cerberus handle this. Besides, we need to work together. Head for the warehouse through the center of the colony. We'll circle around the far side and draw off some of the drones to clear you a path. You expect us to do all the dirty work while you sneak in and grab Vitor? Not likely. We're better equipped for a frontal assault than they are, Commander. If we don't work together, we're not going to get past those mechs. We're moving out. If you want your answers, get to that warehouse. The Seeker swarms. No one can hide. The Seekers find you, freeze you, then the monsters take you away. What happened next? The monsters took the people onto the ship, and then they left. The ship flew away, but they'll be back for me. No one escapes. I think that's probably all we're getting out of him, Commander. We finally find a witness, and he's so off his nut he can't even tell us what he saw. I studied them, the monsters, the swarms. I recorded them with my Omni tool. Lots of readings, electromagnetic, dark energy. We need to get this data to the elusive man. Grab the quarry and call the shuttle to come pick us up. What? Vitor is injured. He needs treatment, not an interrogation. We won't hurt him. We just need to see if he knows anything else. He'll be returned unharmed. Your people tried to betray us once already. If we give him to you, we'll never get the intel we need. Praza was an idiot, and he and his men paid for it. You're welcome to take Vitor's Omnitool data, but please, just let me take him. The people at Cerberus won't hurt him, Tally. You have my word. But we need that information, and it's clear the Quarians don't want to share. Damn it, Shepard! I trusted you! He'll be fine. We promise. But we have to find out all we can about the Collectors. What? No! I don't understand! We need a pickup. Have a medbay standing by. Good luck, Shepard. I hope what you get from Vitor is worth it. Shepard, good work on Freedom's progress. Unfortunately, the Quarium you brought back didn't give us any useful information. He's too far gone. He'll be returned to the Migrant Fleet. But more importantly, you confirm the Collectors are behind the abductions. Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. I'm still finding out about me. Thanks for letting me look at these files. I told you that you could see them later. I get impatient. Bust someone out of prison, they'll probably take what they want. Do not violate the integrity of my ship again. You won't like what happens. Yeah, okay. But I found some interesting stuff. Your friends at Cerberus are into some nasty things. I'm gonna find something I can use. I just know it. If it wasn't for Shepard, you'd all be on board that ship. Shepard? Wait. I know that name. 
Sure, I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Commander Shepard, captain of the Normandy, the first human Spectre, savior of the Citadel. You're in the presence of a god, Delan, back from the dead. Oh, the good people we lost and you get left behind. Figures. Screw this. I'm done with you alliance types. I thought you were dead, Shepard. We all did. Our reunion has to wait. Cerberus brought me back to stop attacks like this. You're with Cerberus now? I can't believe the reports were right. Reports? You mean you already knew? Alliance Intel said Cerberus could be behind our missing colonies. We got a tip that this one could be the next to get hit. I went to Anderson, but he wouldn't talk. But there were rumors that you weren't dead. Worse, that you were working for the enemy. Our colonies are disappearing. The Alliance turned its back on them. Cerberus is the only group willing to do something about it. Bullshit. I know what Cerberus is like. They talk about putting humans first, but at what cost? I wanted to believe that you were alive. I just never expected anything like this. How could you just turn your back on all of us? You betrayed the Alliance. Anderson, you betrayed me. The past is done. You need to focus on what's happening now. You saw it yourself. The Collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reapers. I'd like to believe you, Shepard, but I don't trust Cerberus. And it worries me that you do. What did they do to you? What if they're behind it? What if they're the ones working with the Collectors? Typical Alliance attitude. You're so focused on Cerberus that you're blind to the real threat. I can see you won't listen to reason. You show up after two years and tell me you're working with Cerberus. Sounds like you left reason behind a long time ago. Doesn't matter. I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. It's in my blood. I'm reporting back to the Citadel. I'll let them decide if they believe your story. We both know how that's gonna turn out. The Alliance will try to blame Cerberus, just like you did. With good reason. Cerberus can't be trusted. Goodbye, Shepard. Just... Try to be careful. I think we need to discuss the unique piece of salvage we recovered. For now, we've stored it in Edie's AI Corp. We need better equipment to fight the Reapers. An intact Geth would be invaluable to Cerberus' cyber weapons division. We'll have to disagree on that, ma'am. I saw enough of these things I need in Prime. Space it. Cerberus has a long-standing cash bounty for an intact Geth. I assure you, the reward is significant. I want to know why it has a piece of N7 armor strapped to its chest. Battle trophy, maybe? Would a machine care about that? No. Trophies imply emotions that AIs don't have. I doubt it's more than a convenient field repair. Jacob, it's because of Eden Prime that I'm giving the Geth to Cerberus. Miranda's right. We need better weapons. I have to look at the big picture. Yes, sir. Head to the Normandy. Joker, prep the engines. I'm about to overload this place and blow it sky high. Roger that, Commander. Uh, Commander, I've got an incoming signal from the elusive man. He's patching it through. Shepard, you've done the impossible. I'm not finished here yet. This base is ten minutes from extinction. Wait. I have a better option. I'm looking at the schematics Edie uploaded. A timed radiation pulse would kill the remaining collectors, but leave the machinery and technology intact. This is our chance, Shepard. They were building a Reaper. That knowledge, that framework could save us. I came here to destroy it. But if you have another idea, I'm listening. We've won a single victory, but we're still at war. This base will give us the technology we need to fight the Reapers. Maybe it's for the best. It's better because we'll do it? Shepard, this is way over the line. Your crew needs to understand that billions of lives are at stake. Leadership means making sacrifices. You know that better than anyone, Shepard. A threat this big, rules go out the window. If this station can help stop the Reapers, we have to use it. You're making the right choice.
Let's move. In ten minutes, the reactor core will fire a radiation blast that kills anything on board. Shepard, it's a new day, and we have you to thank for our deliverance. We did the right thing. You don't need to try and make me feel good about it. Always willing to do whatever it takes. Well, it's paid off. Adapting the technology of the Collector Base could be the biggest advancement for humankind since the discovery of the Relays. It will secure our dominance in the galaxy against the Reapers and beyond. Human dominance? Or just Cerberus? They're one and the same. My mission has always been to promote and secure humanity's continued strength. Don't let idealism blind you. Using the base to its fullest potential is the best way to fulfill ours. We need to dedicate every possible resource against the Reapers. Nothing can interfere with that. Harbinger is coming, and he won't be alone. You hold anything back. Anything. And you're out. It's not that easy, Shepard. We need each other. I'm gonna stop the Reapers, but I won't sacrifice the soul of our species to do it. Remember that. <laughs>